what's up guys welcome back once again it is me malt so happy to be here with you guys today i am going to be showing y'all an awesome gar trade that i had earlier look at this base so this is a pretty well upgraded uh town hall nine honestly the walls are really good all the wizards except for one are upgraded pretty well um the mortars are still getting there he does have both of his expos but we are going to do some serious work on this base so we're going to drop off all 20 of our giants in here with some wall breakers to get them up in there um into all of that loot uh so i'm rolling with 20 wall breaker <laughs> with 20 giants um and then i believe it is eight wall breakers and then the rest archers and it's been working pretty well for me as you're going to see from this attack right here so i'm rolling with two lightning spells as well to take out mortars and then uh three heal spells to help heal up the giants uh, there are a bunch of clan council troops in here right now, but we do have uh, our queen in there who's doing some work on them, as well as that heal spell which was keeping them up. We're going to drop off another heal spell right here in the middle. All of our archers are going to come in here and finish taking out the rest of those clan council troops, and then they are going to just completely go to town on the rest of these resources. Uh, thankfully, a lot of those giant bombs missed our archers because they are rolling in a pack. And honestly, when archers are in a pack, guys, they do a ridiculous amount of damage. Watch how fast this gold mine or that gold storage went down. It took like three seconds. Um, so we do have two groups of giants right now, but they are about to group back up up here towards the top of the base. Um, <laughs> and then once that wall breaks, they decide to split up again. And that right there, that bomb or that mortar that just went off and missed that group of archers, was the deciding factor of this raid because that was like 30 archers and since they are not down um it is going to completely change the outcome of this raid because now they're down here by themselves doing some damage and our group of giants is packed up here towards the top we're gonna go ahead and use that cloak ability for the queen and make sure that the giants get the aggro and not the queen since she is the highest damning highest damage dealing troop um, out here for us right now and the giants are really really low health but our queen is doing a good job of taking out these defenses as well again we've got this huge group of archers right here that are just completely crushing anything that they come across uh, they split up right there on the wall which again is a good thing I don't know where they are going right now <laughs> but they are heading up and they're going to take out this air defense and they're going to get to work on this uh, elixir storage and as you can see we've got another huge group up there by the Christmas tree they were pissed because uh, the defender who is a Chinese name did not get them any presents so there we go guys they are about to take out all of this loot over 640 thousand in loot with Garch against a really 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 well upgraded Town Hall 9 especially from the standpoint of the walls which can be one of the biggest uh, factors that cause you to lose with Giants because Giants just beat on them and take forever. Um, here's our Christmas tree base if you haven't seen it yet. If you haven't go watch that other video. I'm going to be showing you guys some replays. It's already been attacked a couple of times. I don't have a shield up right now so that people can just keep attacking it. I don't really know why I'm collecting these but uh, it's still going to the same place. But I hope that you guys like that. I hope that y'all learned a little bit. Um, I always roll with like I said uh, five giants in each barrack, uh, two wall breakers in each barrack, and then 31 archers in each barrack. Um, which ends up being 124 uh, archers. It works really well, as you guys just saw. You can use that same tactic if you want to. Hope you guys are having a great holiday. Again, check down below, guys, if you want information on how to get free gems or iTunes cards. Uh, Cash for Apps is amazing. It works so, so well. I know so many people have already gotten like 40 or $50 in iTunes cards. So definitely try that out, guys. And then stay tuned for more videos over the Christmas break. I'm going to be uploading a lot. Thank you so much for your support. I hope that you guys have great holidays with your family. And just enjoy your time. As always, guys, make sure you keep calm and clash on from it, right? I'll see you guys later. Peace.